recipes the same way our early ancestors did today i share with you a very easy recipe on how to prepare afan soup like a pro so if you want to learn how to prepare this meal watch to the end this is afan it's been sliced already pound it and set it aside then proceed for that to prepare your other ingredients like washing and also slicing your water leaf preparing your meat and also your peppers crayfish and all other ingredients of your choice then place your pot on fire next ingredient you are going to add is going to be your cooked goat meat you can choose to make use of beef or any other protein of your choice also go for that to add your your cooked snails if you have anyone you can go for that to add your curly water leaf at this point if you wish or you allow your stock to remain on fire for just a little while everything was well cooked and well prepared so there was no need for me to allow my stock to stay on fire for a long time so next you're going to do is for you to use a spoon use a toner after adding your water leaf to combine everything together then go for that to also add your crayfish together with your pepper and also go in with your steamed periwinkle you can choose to make use of the, sh the shell or the unshell periwinkle any one of your choice after that use a spoon use a toner combine everything together you can also add your afang at this point or you add your palm oil before adding your fang come on don't look at me in that manner this afang is still gonna look very very sweet and delicious after adding your afang without your oil use your spoon use your toner to mix everything together so that the afang the water leaf the stock can incorporate watching this video up to this very point it means you are in love with our recipes please type it on the comment section i love afang so then tell me where you're watching us from so we could send you a special hug in our next video this is okbon twin it's a scent pepper that has a very sweet aroma add it to your pot and also go in with your palm oil enough palm oil afang soup need enough palm oil i know that a lot of people must have been wondering if i will not add palm oil to my meal the other day i prepared a fang with fresh potato leaf and they almost crucified me and today again i'm adding a fang before adding my palm oil see my beloved friends cooking is all about creativity there is nothing complicated in cooking a fang soup taste and adjust with any lacking ingredient of your choice after adding your a fang don't allow it to stay long again on fire 10 seconds or 20 seconds is okay just bring it off the heat just immediately so that your a fang will still look very fresh okay our soup is ready the taste is out of Afang this soup. It's called Afang, you right? can pair this up with yeah. fufu gari amala or any shualo of your choice so after cooking i started sharing this food for my guests and they really really love it today's hug goes to christian is he wow. watching from cross river state calabar precisely i'm glad you love the recipes let me know where you're watching us from so we could send you a special like hug in our next video also let me know in the comment section if you've loved to try it afang soup okay if you do send us pictures on instagram at baptist underscore nature kitchen thank you for watching god bless you see you in our next one bye I remember last time I had some. If we call this some, some people call it periwinkle. The one I see is, okay, people call it what? Infi. Okay. I've not had the one that is this big for a very, very long time. In our puja, I don't get to see something this big. Yeah. 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 In Abuja, snail is 9,000 naira. Really expensive. Mm. Baptist, this is a grand welcome. I'm sincerely grateful. Mm. This is good food. Hi. I mean, life is not that difficult actually. Get to me.